Hola pequeño artista, soy Mariana Olson y hoy vamos a dibujar un personaje de Minecraft sorpresa. ¿Están listos? Empecemos. Ok, we're gonna need paper, something to color with, I'm using markers, and something to draw with. I'm using a black marker, but you can change it for pencil. Let's start folding our paper. We're gonna top, take the top part and we're gonna align this too. And now we're gonna fold in half. So we're just gonna go like this. Now we're gonna tuck the bottom part and fold it again to the top. We're gonna align these two and we're gonna fold one more time. Now let's flip it over. Now let's take the bottom part and we're gonna fold one more time. Just like this and now we're gonna open this again we're gonna put it down and we're gonna flip it over again. There. Now we're gonna start drawing here. Okay, so now I suggest that you put another piece of paper underneath this one so the markers don't go through the paper into the table. I wanna start drawing first the box that the creeper is coming out. So first we're gonna do on the left side a line that go cross down and now we're gonna continue with another line that go horizontal to the right. So it's gonna go slow, so we try to go as straight as possible. And now let's go down, we cross the folding part, and we go down. And now we're gonna join these two together here, okay? So I'm gonna go from the left to the right, and we're gonna join these two, there. Okay, now the next step is gonna be put some uh, other lines inside. So I'm gonna start with the line on the top, and it's going across really close to the top line. Now underneath the folding part here, we're gonna trace one more and it goes horizontal just like this. And I'm going super slow just to try to go uh, straight. And last one is here close to the bottom line, really close to the bottom line and this is gonna be the last one. So now let's continue with the letters. We're gonna do here, the first one is the letter T and that one is two rectangles. So one here and the other one goes down, just like this. Now the letter N is another rectangle first. And after that, we're gonna do a square. So we leave a little bit of a space and then we do a square and we're gonna do one more here next to this one. They are touching on the corners and now another rectangle, okay? Now the letter T is the exact same thing that we did first, and that's it. Now let's open the paper, and we're gonna start uh, drawing the rest of the box. So I'm gonna do two little lines here, I'm gonna cross here to close it, and the same thing on the top, I'm just extending those lines and close it. Okay, we're gonna start with the feet of the creeper. So the first thing I'm gonna do is two diagonal lines, I'm gonna leave a space in between, and the third line is really little, okay? So it goes kind of like diagonal. So I wanna close these two first, and now I'm gonna close these two, but the line comes diagonal down. Now, let's do one more cube here and behind. Let's start with two lines, one and two. Now let's close these two together, let's join them with another line. Now I'm gonna do here a little diagonal lines and now we're gonna join them. Let's do one more line to close this cube right here and stop and now we join these two together. There. I'm gonna do here two lines, two little lines. So the first one comes from this corner up and a diagonal line and another one the same thing down here. Now we're gonna do a line that goes up and it's gonna be long in between these two little lines I just did and goes up and cross a little bit of the folding part. So let's go super slow so it goes straight up and we cross here a little bit. Now I'm gonna do two more but first I'm gonna close these two together and I'm gonna do a horizontal line from this corner to the right and it looks like this. Okay now I'm gonna do two more lines so we're gonna go from this corner up and it's gonna be the same height as the first line I did. So we just stop right there, they are the same height. 
I'm gonna do one more, kind of like I'm leaving a space of a finger and here I'm gonna do another one. And this one is a little bit higher than the first ones. Now I'm gonna finish the feet here with another cube. I'm gonna do a line here, another one, really close to the corner, not quite there. And one more, this is a tiny one right here, okay? Now, let's join this corner with this one. It's going to cross over the little one and touch the box. And now, from this point, I'm going to go diagonal up, diagonal up, and now let's join them. Good. Now, let's here make a line that is going to join these here, these two together. And that's it for the feet. Now we can finish the top part. The first thing I want to do is join these two lines and I'm going to cross over and pass a little bit, just like this. You see how much I did here? Now let's do the same thing here where I join, join these two. And remember, the, the first line of the last line here is a little higher, so we pass that. We leave also space. And now from this point I'm going up and I stop right here. And now I want to finish the this part was going to be the face. So let's go right, and now let's join them. There. Now let's do the same here. We're gonna go up or down, and join these two together. There. And now I'm gonna do the top top part. So here I need a diagonal line just like this one. I'm gonna do here, connect with the corner. And the last one is going to just close this part. There. We just need the eyes to finish this creeper. So the eyes are two uh, squares. So we're going to do here one. And let's do the other one. And the next step is going to be the nose or part of the mouth. And uh, here I'm doing a rectangle and I want to do two more in each corner. This is the first one, and in this corner, I'm doing the last one. And that's it! we finished! I hope you enjoyed drawing with me this lesson, and I hope you have patience to try and try again if this one don't come for you the first time. And, and now we're gonna fold it to see how this look when it's closed, and it's just like this. Now we open it and surprise! And now my favorite part is coming. Let's color! If you like this video, don't forget to give us a big thumbs up, share with your friends, and subscribe to the channel. See you next time!